hello everyone last time we have seen uh, function of bone all these are the function of bones and now we will pass about the classification of bones bones are classified by their shape rather than size as long short flat and regular so bones can be cl classified into four long bones short bones flat bones irregular bones let us see long bones long bones are considerably longer than they were their widths their widths so the length is greater than widths in long bones so the bones of arms arms uh, for instance if you take uh, arms for arms legs hands feet are long bones for instance if you take humerus humerus bone is arm bone so its length is greater than widths so we can consider that as long bone so uh, wrists and ankles wrist bones and ankle bones are uh, not uh, long bones why because wrist bones are carpal bones so carpal bones are like scaphoid and uh, like lunate like, like that uh, hamate like that all are they are li almost the length in which are proportional so they are short bones they are short bones so the second group is known as short bone the second classification short bones are roughly cube shaped or cube shaped means almost their length is their height is uh, uh, equal to uh, way length length is greater than length is equal to width or length is equal to height is equal to width so the bones of wrists and ankles ankles for instance wrist bones are like carpal uh, wrist bones are carpal bones carpal bones are like sca scaphoid scaphoid but ankle bones ankle bones are like uh, ankle bones are uh, we can take an example like uh, uh, like like intermediate bones and the like we will see it uh, like uh, so uh, ankles are uh, ankle bones are there seven but the wrist bones are there eight so uh, flat bones are thin flattened and usually curved uh, the ribs shoulder blades and cranial bones are grouped under uh, flat bones so the other is the fourth one is the regular bones have varied shapes regular means varied many surface markings for muscle attachment like vertebrae vertebral column or vertebrae hip bones and facial bones are grouped under regular bones the other is sesamoid bone is a special type of short bones a special type of short bones uh, uh, denoting a small nodular bone embedded in the tendon or joint capsule example is patella or kneecap is considered as a sesamoid bone the other is pneuma pneumatic bone have empty space within them so short flat short bones flat bones irregular bones are all made up of sponge bone uh, sponge bone means which is covered with a thin layer of uh, compact bone that means they have um, mostly they are spongy but the outer covering uh, is a compact bone a compact bone so uh, this is all about the classification of bones they have four basic types of uh, uh, font types when we see the examples long bone example is humerus this is humerus bone arm bone so length is greater than width. short bones carpal carpal carpals of wrist like carpal bones like uh, uh, scaphoid bone uh, and uh, this is the uh, bones short bones uh, this is the uh, carpal bones and the other is uh, flat bone flat bone is like this is a parental bone they are flat curved bone so consider that so the other is vertebral considered as uh, flat bone the other is vertebral column like carpal as uh, like vertebrae this vertebrae is a regular bone vertebra or vertebrae is considered a regular bone there are many regular surface for muscle attachment so these are examples of um, bone classifications structures of la typical long bone with few exception all bones in the body have some general the same general structure this is uh, diaphysis uh, this is diaphysis diaphys for, for instance uh, this is a uh, bone for instance 